What's up, Legends? Very important day today. Today is the day that we see the outcome of my grandfather. Now, you guys know he has a lot going on here. You tune in the episode. So my grandfather, of course, is a diabetic, but he also has uh, dialysis, uh, which is a process that cleans your blood because your blood needs cleaning. It takes your blood out of you and puts it back inside of you and cleans it. Well, one of his entries that he uses to get his blood out of his body is clogged. Very serious procedure, supposed to be about 90 minutes in Fairview. Um, so guys, we, we're waiting for the outcome of that. You know, if that's okay and he's okay, then we're all clear to go to uh, Mill to Grill um, to celebrate uh, uh, what an awesome gathering and community we have. So you tuned in, guys. So wait, so they said they were gonna come at five? Yeah. And they didn't show up? They haven't shown up because sometimes they have other people to drop off. And that's the only one available. They didn't call you? No, they can't call me. The nurse has to call the nurse. And the nurse is the one they get a hold of him. Them. Well, we're going to go get a pizza. Here, they take their own good old time. And cheesy bread. Unless they're busy. And a side of anchovies that I think. What forgot. time is it? Huh? What time is it? Uh, five five twenty eight. No way. They're thirty minutes late. Yeah. Oof. All right, so we got the pizza. Delivered and ready. We're going in. Yeah, we need we need to figure out the verdict. Everything came out okay. Yeah. Oh, man. Woo. The verdict. The verdict is in. Um, pretty much, he had a procedure. Um, it was supposed to be what? At, what three? An hour and a half? Yeah. Ninety minutes? But they were done in. Yeah. They were done in what? Yeah. Half an hour. So things came out okay, and we fixed the problem, and we're about to go share some Masters Pizza with Grandpa as we speak. All right, so we got <laughs> Ann Chovies. How'd your surgery go? How did it go? Yeah, how you feeling? Oh, all right. Well, guess what? We got really good news. What's the good news? The doctor said it went good. You're good. I was worried. Yeah? Yeah, I was worried. Oh, who'd you see, that doctor? That's, that's irrelevant. What's relevant is that you're okay, and we're updating the fans right now. So say something, say something to the whole world right now. Hey, Me. people! I just I just want to announce the fact that I'm all right. That everything went all right, and I'm here to testify to that. Okay. And hit him with hit him with something that. What do you want to tell the world? I want to tell the the world. My my quote. My quote is this. I'm I'm number one. Received. But I'm here just to tell the world that that my meeting is still there. Go with the short thing. Colonial pen. Although my meaning colonial pen guaranteed acceptance whole life insurance for more than fifty years. And with good reason. If you're between the ages is, of fifty is, and is, it's a short thing. Your acceptance is guaranteed with a, because with the cat paid in the first two years. You don't need a physical exam and you won't ask about your health. 
The cat has to be there. He's part of the part. Right. Yeah. yeah. Well, we're gonna go get this cat, and we're glad you're together. He wants to go on a prowl. Hey, the cat was in the Matrix, so I know what I know what cat you're referring to. You're a genius. Okay. Something that I would never understand is how you like anchovies so much. But right now we got an anchovy slice of pizza coming in very slowly. But instead of a train, we're going to do a plane. What an anchovy bite. Look at that. You taste that anchovies? Man, I can't. What is it? Okay, so an anchovy is what? That's just fish or is that a... And it looks like an octopus tentacle. Mm. I feel like I know that answer because anchovies were the bad guys in SpongeBob. Remember that? Oh, yeah. So they were just doing their little thing. Is that enough anchovies or what? Because Chapo, what did you say? I, I made it so the anchovies were in every single bite. And I didn't know. Did I over anchovy? Here, we'll see right now. Okay, so the plumber is back. It's a week later. We got clearance from Grandpa. We're in the hoarder house and look at the progress we've made, guys. Check it all out. The plumber said, you've been making a lot of progress in here. It looks a lot different. Look at that, guys. Wow. Empty shelves. Got a couple more things that need to be picked up. But for the most part, we are looking good. You said it looks a lot different here, huh? Yeah, yeah man. We've been trying to super work, man. <laughs> super duper work. I still got all these mason jars and all that kind of other stuff. Heck yeah. I'm gonna let you do your thing, man. I don't wanna distract you. All right, you're good. I'll let you know when I'm done. All right, man. Actually, now I gotta figure out if these are even worth anything. Hmm. Wow. Talk about some progress. Talk about progress, guys. All right, let me show you the upstairs. Okay. So, this is the... This is, I don't want to, I don't want to mess Chapel up. She's on the phone right now. But this is the living room. Looks great. We gotta just set up and sell some stuff. Oh my gosh, I got a $300 gas bill. And then here goes this room. We actually picked up all of this stuff. I'm gonna try to see if we can sell like both of those furniture pieces as a set and um, this as a single unit and that as a single unit. Um, yeah, and that's, I would say if I were to appraise this, I mean, just to get rid of it, I would say like 50 bucks on that. I would say probably about, probably mm, 50 to 70 on both of those. And then that like 10, 20 bucks. That's my appraisal on the furniture. But I, I'm very like, I price things very competitively. Look, this is, let me see. Oh, this is something cool. This is like an old club, right? I'm pretty sure, right? They used to use this to hit people. It's pretty cool. Let's see what we got in here. So some banking company.
This is going to be the office, guys, where all the toys are. And I'm gradually just grabbing toys. Like, look at this Taz right here. Check that out. Candy hander. There's way more cards in the in the in the closet. And we've just been pulling up a bunch of toys. These are all of the vintage cups. We're gonna try to sell those. Um, a lot of work to do, but man, what look at the progress. If we go outside, take a look outside. I bet you I could show you the garage. So yeah, I just realized it was snowing out. So since it's snowing out, I don't really think it'd be like the best option to show you the outside garage just cause it's freezing. Um, actually, I'm just gonna show it to you. Okay, so for the most part, we're making good progress cause we got all that out. You guys seen in the last episode. And then we're digging in here. I guess since I got out here, it's freezing a little bit, but since I'm out here, we should probably open a box. Okay. I'm going up top. So what the heck all this is? Ah. Whoa. Ooh, looks like an old bowl. Okay, hunking. Porcelain cow. Let's not lose. Remember, the keys are there, guys. Don't, don't want to lose them. Okay, what the heck is all this? It's like a wood thing of some sort. Oh, that looks like um, is that a shower curtain, maybe? What is all this? Oh, what are those? Food keepers? This is a whole box of food keepers. No way. I don't know what the heck all that is. But this looks like maybe like to like a model or something. When you um Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure. I'm not sure guys. Let's go. We're going back in. What do we got? Essentials, what the heck? A whole entire box of carrots and dipping sauce trays. Little food trays, that's, that's not bad. I mean, every single one of those should go. Everybody has parties and get togethers. Or, you know, essentials, those are cool, those are cool. Not as cool as comics, but they're cool. Whoa. All right, so we have a whole entire box. It says glass material. Okay, now that says, what does that say? Chase, chase material. Okay. What the heck? Whoa. This is a whole box of these old school ball gun things. They're called softball shooters. Wow. That's a nice vintage find right there. Oh, look, there's a whole entire box of belts. Whoa, those look intense. Okay, let's figure out. Okay, I'm getting sidetracked here. My, my ADHD is taking over, guys. Oh, I just broke that. I just I just broke that uh that vase. I gotta be more careful. Okay. Let's see what's in here. Looks like what is this? Office binders? Teacher resource book, Merle Mathematics. Hmm. Okay, wait a minute. No way. No. No. 
There is not a whole box of these. All the way down, what is this? Book, material, text, tour, functions, fractions. Oh my gosh. Ladies and gentlemen, I think that there is, let me see. Oh my gosh, no! Why are you storing this? There is no reason to store this! Oh my gosh! This is outdated math books! With, with just tables of contents, guys, there's no... There's no context. It's only tables of contents. No. All right, guys. I got to get these out. The boxes are actually good. We could actually use the boxes for shipping, but you know what? These got to get out the garage. All right. So now that we move those out the way, we still got rows and rows of boxes. That's for sure. Definitely a lot of boxes. What the heck is that? Comic collector, two milk jugs. Huh. There's balls. Sheesh. Whoa. Whoa. We might have to bring this one inside. That looks like some patches. So we just brought the box inside from the garage. I did, I did here, restart that please. All right guys, so I just got inside the house from the garage. We've seen some really cool boxes. I just got this box from the garage and we're here to open it up. Chapel just got done paying the gas bill. The gas bill was, how much was the gas bill? $320. $320. Plus guys. the service fee. Plus the service fee, oof. Not good. Not good, guys. Those are killing me. Oh. Straight from the garage, guys. Leather on leather. I don't know if these are bracelets. These might be bracelets of some sort here. Crazy. This is what caught my eye right here. Look at this. Oh, my goodness. This is so Wow, look at all these Harley Davidson patches, motor company style. Look at that motor Harley Davidson cycles, Suzuki. Oh my goodness, Yamaha. Wow, look, another Harley, guys. These gotta be 50 to 100 bucks a piece at least. At least, look at this, an old school Yamaha. You see the Yamaha right there? They're iron on, I think. Wow, oh my gosh, Harley Davidson cycles. This one's like stitch. I think some are iron and some are stitch. The iron on, you can tell because there's like stickiness on there when it heats up. Hold on, let's see. More Harley Davidson. Look at this Honda. Wow, Honda with an with an eagle, just like the Harley, but Honda, Honda Suzuki, Harley. They were big back then. They still they're still big now, but look at that one, two, three, and four Harley Davidson patches. Absolutely incre incredible. Look at this one. Wow, got the. USA got the three stars. Ooh, this has got that nice little stitching and then has a USA. We got about five of those. Wow, man, what a good bag. That's a really good bag there. Harley Davidson patch. There goes another Harley. Harley motorcycles. Look at this. Harley Davidson motorcycles. That's, wow. This is definitely one of those bags that we won't forget that's thousands let's see what's in the rest of the box here okay 
Wow, just like, like a ton of leather. These look like they're together. I wonder what this is. Oh, it's like a little kid's vest. Wow. A size two. That is crazy. So we got a bunch of those. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine of those, 10, 11, 12. Those, these are other, oh, look at this one right here. Whoa, old school. What's that say? Ravenna? Ravenna? That looks pretty old, old school Mexican dress shirts. One, two, three. Uh-oh, what's this? Oh, look, there's a puppet, a little Mexican guy. Uh, 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 uh. Wow, no way. Look at him. Let me see if I can untangle this. With two revolvers in his hand. Oh my gosh. That guy is crazy. That's probably worth some money. I don't know if there's like a brand on this at all, but that, puppets are worth money. People love puppets. Sheesh. We should name them. What do you think? Down below. What do you think? I'm call him. Call him Frankie. Frankie? Mm -hmm. Frankie the puppet. Here, excuse him out of two. He's gonna get stanky. You see his um. You see, he has like red on his face. I think he's probably getting stanky right now. He's like red, like he's like peed off or something. Check out his fit. Yeah, he's got a nice little tie. Yellow tie, got a nice little red stripe around the chest. Hat slicked backwards, like. Yeah, it's like, really shows, really taking a, taking a toll on him. Mm hmm And you know, honestly, I wonder if we can adjust that. Nope, we can't even adjust the hats. You can tell, like, he's been hit with the wind a couple times. I think he likes his hat a certain way. Mm -hmm. And then look at these chanclas. Oh, there goes Frankie. Oh, those stompers. Yeah, these are going to be caught. Stomp all over you if you give Frankie an attitude. We'll call these the Virginia beaches. All right, what is this right here? This looks like a, a necklace of some sort. What the heck? Oh, it's a pipe. There's a net in there? And then there's a pipe when you starfish. That's crazy. Check that out. They're all like, they're all in like one big, like bunch. That's weird. That's crazy. Who would have thought? These boxes are so random. It's crazy. Look, and then we got two more, two more dress shirts. Not bad, guys. Not a bad. Actually, a really good box. One of the better boxes in the garage, honestly. I think we're really underestimating how much those, um, those, Harley Davidson patches are, let's just say for instance, the Harley Davidson patches are about 50 bucks a piece. There was at least, I'm talking, there's probably like at least 40 in here. And if that's the case, guys, that's $2,000. If it's not 40, I don't know, it's a lot of money. All right, so we're going back in the garage to see what we can find. Let's see. All right, we're back, I'm better than ever. Actually, you know what? I wanna see these belt buckles. Oh my gosh, look at this. Oh, I see a stuff lounge coming, hang on. Okay, so, still got all these awesome boxes. Forgot about that. Some cool boxes. 
Oh yeah. This, this box itself is literally deteriorated to almost nothing. So I think I think the only thing that's in the box itself is one. Yep, and two. Belt buckles. This is just a super moldy box, so I'll throw that out there with the Merle, with the Merle Mathematician binders, and and we'll take, we'll probably try to take those in. I don't know what this is. Oh, look at that! Wow, Walleye Country, Sandusky, Ohio, Port Clinton. Oh man, these are good hats. Those are nice. Yeah, that's a really nice. Really nice thing of hats there, I'll tell you that. I'll take those out. I see some gloves down here. Should be wearing the gloves. The gloves are right there. Those are really good gloves to work with. Hmm. It's like I want to leave, guys, but I want to keep digging. You know, it's like a combination of both. I want to go inside to show you the belts, but I also want to keep Hmm. Wonder what's in ooh, wonder what's in this right here. Oh man, let's see what's in this. Can't help myself, guys. Here we go. Hopefully it's something good. Here we go. What is it? Oh glasses. That's pretty good. The glasses sell like crazy. Oh my gosh. Sunglasses. A whole sunglass box. Worth money. The heck is all of these? Oh man. Oh, we got purses. Tons of purses. Okay. Whoa. Rings. No way, vintage rings. Oh my gosh, a bunch of them. Oh, no way. Oh, there's a bunch of rings. Oh yeah, we're bringing this in. We're bringing this in. All right, guys. Whoa. Okay, I gotta focus on one thing. So first things first, put these on top of these and then bring it in. All right, <clears throat> so we're inside. We're taking a full look at all of these belt buckles. Look at that Volkswagen, Tony, skateboarder. Oh my gosh, look at how many belts are in here. This is crazy. Doug. Roger, I'd rather be jogging. Whoa, January seventh, February eighteenth. Oh, that's a that's a um zodiac. Larry, wow! Look at all these guys. This is crazy. Look, here goes more zodiacs. Oh, Sagittarius. Wow. Crazy. Chad. Roger. Solid brass. Wow. So these are all brass. That's crazy. Look, there's a shell. Dad. Libra. There's a truck.
spray. There's so much here. It's ridiculous. There's just so, look at this, Mercedes. Oh, man. They definitely have the cool ones, to say the least. I'm, trying to, I'm probably going to get them out this nasty box. Look at that. Whew. All solid brass. Belt buckles, guys. Big red chewing tobacco. Sheesh. A baseball. Honda. Beth. Oh, shout out to Beth Ellen. Ted, Henry, Elvis, oh my gosh, International Harvester, sheesh guys, wow. Crazy! I'll take that box out. This is just nuts. There's so many different belt buckles in here. Toyota. Skiing. Sheesh. Through the rest of this box. Got a really nice purse here. Nice leather purse. Couple more bags. See, he sold these for like 17 bucks alone back then. Nice handbags. These were probably super in style back then. We got another one. We also have like beads. I don't know what this is. These are what, all catalogs? It says investment. This is like an investment booklet. Okay, and then we got beads, super value pack beads. A couple of those. Oh, let's see what's in here. Oh, these are little cho change pouches. Probably put them around your wrist or something. Genuine cowhide. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, look at this. Wow, look at all of these old school rings. This is crazy. Wow. All the old school rings from the 70s, guys. The vintage designs. Look at all the vintage designs. That's a crazy design right there. It's like a... Uh, I don't even know how to describe that. Got the skull with the crowns. A little turquoise design. More designs, let's see. Look at that, that is crazy. Wow. So those are super cool rings and look under this, wow. He has a whole entire, look, these are old school workout pens. That's crazy right there, let me see the back of them. Yeah, they're all pins, wow. That's really cool. So we have frog pins and workout pins. And then under here is just nothing but just rings. Crazy. Sold these for a dollar each back then. Oh my gosh. Look at all of these rings. Just the vintage appeal alone. There's Harley Davidson rings in here. Butterfly designs. Man, look at all of these rings. Oh my. Gosh. I bet you these are all men's sizes. Mm -mm. Look at that. You got, oh, let me flip them around here. You got Indians rings, skull rings, magnet rings. You got 
imitation turquoise. I mean, you know it. Let's see here. Look at this right here. Just the tray alone. Look at that tray. Finger rings. All the vintage costume jewelry, guys. This is worth hundreds, if not thousands of dollars, guys. Easily. Let's see what else we got here. Wow, a bunch of got way more rings. Look at all of this. We have a bunch of vintage Super Bowl champion Redskins. Old school Cleveland Browns. Redskins, Cleveland Browns. More Redskins. Wow, that's a good team to have, guys. They don't have Redskins anymore. More Redskins. More Redskins. Uh-oh, looks like some cards here. Ooh, Corey Snyder. More. Oh, what is that? Chicago Bears. Redskins. Bears. Let's see what's in here. Whoa, a belt buckle of a car. That's really cool. There's tons of stuff. Look at this. More vintage costume jewelry. Oakland Raiders. All teams that aren't even in existence anymore. We got a watch. A couple fans. This, I think, is another, yeah, look at that, another vintage belt buckle. Man, these are like 40 bucks a piece, the belt buckles alone, guys. Man, what a good, what a good box. We got a binder under this, actually. Let's see what this is. This might be a good binder. Who knows? Oh, it's, it's filled. It's filled. One, two. Whoa. From the 80s. Oh, the baseball. It's not leaking, so. The drain isn't leaking. It's not leaking. It was running down from the faucet. Oh, okay. But here we go. Yeah. Oh. You can have this on for that oh. to go. <laughs> Sorry if I sprayed you there. That kind of <laughs> shot up. Oh, dude, that is sweet. Oh, one thing I got to give you, man. I plan on giving it to you, man. Oh, yeah. Yeah, here, take that, man. That's Thank on the do. house, man. Thank yeah, for do. sure, man. <laughs> for sure. This thing, is, this thing is cool, man. It's actually worth a lot of money because they're actually, <laughs> like, alcohol, I, I don't think expires. No. It's so you can still butter. drink it. Yeah, so those are pretty sought after. Mm -hmm. That's why your uh, father-in-law probably collects it. <laughs> Super cool, <laughs> man. Yeah, for sure, man. Thanks for your service, man. <laughs> You killed it. That was the episode. Thank you so much for watching. Super awesome news. Grandpa's okay. Thanks for you know sharing sharing your interest in my channel, and um, and hit that subscribe button. Uh, everybody have a blessed, safe weekend, and I'll see you guys later.